All right, guys, welcome back. Hear Me Out podcast, and this is going to be a quick one. We'll talk more about it in depth a little later with the guys, but I want to report something here for you guys. Probably already heard it. Um, Tyrod Taylor, the, I was about to say San Diego, the LA Chargers new quarterback, Tyrod Taylor, right? He didn't start in this last game, and I was kind of curious when I turned it on. I still forget sometimes that Phillip Rivers is not the quarterback for that team anymore. So when I seen this other guy back, I don't even know his name, but the backup for the Chargers, I was like, what is going on? Turns out that they were trying to give Tyrod Taylor some type of pain reliever, painkiller, which was a straight injection from a needle to his cracked ribs. And apparently this is a very common practice in the NFL where they inject this uh, pain reliever, painkiller, whatever, and they got to put it directly to the affected area where they need pain to be relieved right and in this case it was his ribs Tyrod Taylor with crack ribs and they put it right above so it can trickle down a little bit the side of his body and turns out they punctured his lungs how the fuck do you do that so you're a team doctor for the LA Chargers right and you just damaged the franchise cornerstone I guess because Tyrod Taylor's getting paid a lot of money People expected him to come there and uh, put in work with that team. So the fact that he's not out there is, is going to make some fantasy owners piss. It's going to make the owners of the team piss. It's going to piss off the organization, the players, everybody involved. That's crazy. I, how do you do that? And what's the next move here for Tyrod Taylor? Is he going to sue? I would sue everybody in this. Anyone that I can possibly get money from, I'm cleaning them out. So this team doctor is definitely going to get fired. Um... Man, it's a shitstorm coming his way. Uh, whoever this doctor is, God bless you, man. And they said it was a 0.01% chance that something like this would happen. Uh, they probably write it somewhere within the um, within the paperwork of some of a procedure like this that this would probably happen. Tyrod Taylor is going to be out for the unforeseeable future. Punctured lungs, man. That's that's serious. You know the lungs here and your body that you need to breathe right so Tyrod Taylor I don't know how long he's going to be out for um he was a former Bills quarterback for those that may not remember who he is he was on the up and ups until now and it was looking bright for him to come into LA big market uh big team with the Chargers you know a team with a lot of history for being a good NFL team and now you got this team doctor damaging the property of the team it's crazy and we'll talk more about it later, like I said. Um, if you guys like the content, subscribe. Leave a comment. What do you think about this? How would you react if you're a football player and the doctor fucks you up to the point where you can't even play anymore, man? That's crazy. Is that something that you can forgive and move on? Or do you say, you cost me my job, motherfucker, I'm taking you to court? Because that's what I would do. This guy is out of a starting quarterback job in the NFL. Um, he is in critical not critical condition but like he is now unhealthy right something that you know obviously he already had problems with the body but something puncturing your lungs cannot be good i don't know the severity of it at this moment the more we find out the more we'll talk about it uh we're gonna talk about it too with the guys like i said bt hot media and uh franco i don't know if he, he might be in there too we'll see and yeah we'll catch you guys in the next video